What's up, everybody? This is the Fan Dude 21 back once again. What you're looking at here today is a Silcon ceiling fan. This is a model SCF UCC 52. Definitely a pretty interesting fan. These are manufactured by the E Sheen Industrial Corporation out of Taiwan. Like I said, definitely an interesting fan. Fairly hard to find. These are pretty much only sold in the state of Florida. And I think this was possibly their only offering of from the company is this design here. But I also think they manufactured a top mount spinner as well because I did find one at Habitat, which was, you know, had the same style canopy, the stepped canopy there. And also the cast, you know, it looked just like a Silcon as well, but it was a top mount spinner. But unfortunately, I didn't get it as it was missing its original switch housing cap. So, I knew finding a replacement one would be damn near impossible. But, as you can see, um, the fan is pretty unusual looking, as it uses a stamped blade iron there, more uh, seen to top mount spinners, like I said before. Arch end blades. The motor is stamped steel. Um, pretty decent sized motor as well. I'm not sure what the millimeters of it is. Probably might be a 172 or a 188 millimeter motor. Switch housing on the fan is cast. And it even has the stamping, has the Silicon logo stamped into the bottom of the switch cap too, which I find pretty interesting. This is a three speed fan, electrically reversible. Um, yeah, nothing else I'll say about it. I'll say the fan dates sometime around early to mid-80s, 83, 84, if I were to guess. Use the double claw mount. Got this from a fellow fan collector in Florida. I've always halfway one on one of these fans, and he sold this one. He had three of them for sale. I bought one, this one off him for pretty cheap, so yay me. So we'll shut up and go ahead and demonstrate this fan. Start up here on the slow speed. Bearings on the fan seem to be in good condition. Low speed on the fan is pretty average. Not real slow aesthetically, but not too awful fast. Possibly a bit fast for normal low. Take the medium. The fan uses cool taps for speed control. Instead of full capacitors, it is a PSE motor with a capacitor, but they use speed. But this one uses a speed coil for its speed regulation. So the speeds, surprisingly, are not too bad. You know, cool taps are known to have a very faint difference in speeds, but this one here seems to be pretty decent. And the fan does wobble. I would say it's probably a balance an issue on that one aspect because I do have the blades pretty much aligned. One was out of clock when I got it and I bent everything back to pretty true but it still wobbles so and we'll go ahead and take it to its high speed. High speed, we're probably, I would say around 170, possibly 180 RPM. Pretty normal high speed for the fan, nothing too fast. The fan does move a pretty good amount of air, though. It's probably got a 12, 13 degree blade pitch. The performance is pretty decent, despite its slower speed. This is definitely more of a residential motor for lower speed and higher torque. And we'll 
we'll just stop the fan here. And flop it into reverse mode. And this is back to low. Reverse speeds are pretty much identical. So we'll just fly through these real quick. That's low. That's medium. Reversing switch on the fan is actually placed like the ones on Casablanca fans. They're placed, they're notched into the bottom of the switch as and they're held in by clips. The switch cap actually holds it up in place. Here's high speed once again. Once again, pulling the same RPMs on high. Then we'll go to the coast. Another interesting thing of note are the vent screens on, on these fans. Normally they're like a felt material, cloth material, possibly even you know leather normal in some cases as well. But these, this fan here actually uses a steel mesh, fine mesh like you see on window screens, screen doors. Same type of material for vent screens on this fan, which is pretty cool. That means they won't deteriorate, which is what a lot of other companies should have done as well. I, I'm full. I'm fully with that idea there, because you see a lot of oh, these older fans. The vent screens are deteriorating from age, but these will pretty much last as long as a fan does. And there we go, folks. So there was the Silcon ceiling fan model SCF UCC 52. Manufactured sometime in the early 1980s, 1983, 84-ish. And well, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And of course, we'll see you next time.